hello and welcome guys to a little show off about light trail photography. Um, I'm today or this evening here with my friend Lucas and he helps me out uh, and he's also a good guy because he has a lot of good ideas in mind. Firstly, what is light trail photography? The classic way of light trail photography is these photos you're seeing right now where you're standing on the street and looking at the street with these light trails from the cars. But tonight we're trying something else. We're trying to write something in the air. You can write light trails with a torch or with some sparklers and this will give you very very nice pictures and we're going to show you how it works so what do you need to do photos like this you need a camera some kind of dslr so, so that you can work manual because uh, in this uh, type of photography you're never working with an automatic mode so be sure to switch your autofocus off and work in manual mode and then you need some kind of tripod or anything uh, like this you can place your camera on then you need some kind of tools which you can use to draw your drawings and this can be any light source like a torch a sparkler or even your handy would work then of course you need a nice scenery to make the photo looking interesting even the weather is important when you're shooting outside because when you have things that can move like a tree or a lamp or something like that uh, you should have no wind at all because if you shoot in the pictures and they move they won't be sharp on your picture so what are the best settings you can take there's actually no rule what kind of settings you have to take because it's depending on the situation you got um, definitely you need a long shutter speed and it has to be as long as you need to draw your drawing the ISO has to be as deep as possible because uh, if you have a too high ISO you will have too much noise in your picture the cover has to be be pretty wide open because we're shooting in the dark but as I said it's depending on the situation you got. In our situation we're lighting up our scenery with a lamp so in our situation we have more light than usual. After you have set everything in place you can start drawing with your torch while the camera is shooting. In our opinion we try to ride love in the air and that's the result. We did the same thing with the sparkler and important is when you're doing that you don't shoot stand on the same place too long because if you do that you will be on the picture too. And that's the result of our second try. Thanks for watching guys, I hope you liked the video. A rating would be very appreciated. Up in the middle you can subscribe if you don't want to miss any future stuff. Have a nice day guys, stay awesome!